Hey guys, Aaron here doing a review. Today it is going to be a coffee review. Today is 8 o'clock original. This is my second favorite since I was introduced to uh, uh, Dunkin' Donuts. But, uh, <laughs> right, let's go ahead and smell it. Kind of earthy, a little bit of spice in there. Um, and basically, you guys, when I brew a cup of coffee and review it, it's in a six ounce and not a ten ounce, so it might be a little strong in a six ounce. But, um, um, go ahead and taste it. And this is a medium rose, and it is a little, I think, a little on the medium dark side, but um, it's really good. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. The reason why, it, at the end, it gives you just a little bit of coffee, not like most coffees do, but still, I'm going to give it a 9 and a half. Um, but, um, yeah, so you can pick this up in bag and K cups, so go get some of this. Uh, it is good stuff. Um, further reviews. Probably some Zavita Organic. Um, maybe. I don't know how I took it from. Mm. Let's see. Uh, Bigelow Earl Grey, JFC, JFG Bonus Man, Folgers Black Silk, Cafe Bustella, Maxwell House Dark, uh, Hawaiian Kona, Javalia French Roast, Starbucks Holiday, and Zavita Organic, and Maxwell House Master Boom. So, all those might be further reviews that I will be doing. Um, maybe possibly for another tea. Maybe Pompa Herbal Camel Mill. And I just uh, uploaded a review of Lindsay Garden Camel Mill. So, go check that out. Um, so, links in this is really good stuff. See you guys.